hi all uh, this is tutorial 13 of cadence virtuoso in this tutorial i am going to discuss the procedure for doing the gain compression and uh, total harmonic distortion or harmonic distortion analysis for uh, rf circuits in adl so i am taking the same op amp which i used earlier for spare minute analysis so while while doing uh, this uh, gain compression and uh, phd analysis we have to define this input port and output port so again i'll be going for analog lip and selecting port here mm. go and log lip and select the port here and, uh, choose the symbol view okay so let's take it first like this and one at input one at output uh, and connecting with ground also other port okay so at the input we have to do some settings go to properties and uh, 50 ohms is uh, this uh, resistance port number let's give it uh, let's give some name and uh, vdd uh, sorry dc input voltage uh, i'll take 1 volt by uh, we, we can take also vdd by 2 like 0.9 or point depending upon our specs frequency name so it is the frequency uh, I'm keeping I'm keeping it variable and then the frequency one which is the fundamental frequency so I'll give it fund and amplitude I'll take in in uh, dBm so and I'm keeping it also variable so amp so this is the uh, setup which you have to read the input of uh, your circuit okay and then go to the output port go ahead again to properties here just keep it as a DC and uh, this 50 ohm resistance okay so this is the setup which you have to do for gain compression and third harmonic uh, total harmonic distortion analysis so once this is done check and save it go to launch adl and first of all what i'll do is i'll define the ground and vdd so go here ground is zero vdd is 1.8 okay so then the next step is to define my variable so i'll go here bring my variables from cell view so amplitude since it's in dbm so i'm giving it in minus 2k apply and uh, fundamental frequency let's give uh, 50k okay okay so once this uh, variables you are defined then go to your choose analysis go here pss this is that is as it is and uh, go for auto calculate uh, for bit frequency number of harmonics let's take 10 mm, accuracy is moderate then what else uh, yeah sweep i'll be sweeping the amplitude i think i have taken minus 2k okay so i'll be sweeping let's say minus 4k to 4k okay and uh, number of steps and take and take 20 okay and this is it this is the setup you have to do for gain compression and uh, total harmonic distortion calculation okay once this is done run so what actually uh, the gain compression is uh, what happens in most of the R rf circuits the small signal gain gets reduced as the inputs uh, signal amplitude increases therefore the name is gain compression so the point where there is 1 db in uh, this uh, reduction we call this a 1 db compression point uh, so i'll be going here direct plot main form and uh, pss function i'll choose compression point select uh, keep it as it is port fixed report format output power input effort here 1 db compression point i want to see and i'll take the fundamental frequency which i have chosen okay and uh, once you have chosen this don't click anything else not okay nothing and then go to the port where you want as it is asking here select port on schematic so click here so it will show a graph so this is this is the point so the 1 db compression point is a point where these two graphs meet okay so if you see uh, the 1 db compression point for this circuit is minus 2.799 k 
similarly you can if you want to see 3d or 4 uh, like that you can go here again and again so this is the procedure to find the 1 db compression point for our circuit now the next thing is uh, to find the harmonic distortion so for harmonic distortion we will cho we'll choose this function the vo voltage and uh, select net as it is and, uh, here sweep uh, spectrum because we are going to take fft and uh, the modifier will take db20 then the amplitude which i have defined and uh, i'll go here and select the net where i want to see the harmonic distortion let's say i am i want to see at the output so select it this is the plot for harmonic distortion okay and uh, then next is the total harmonic distortion so actually what, what happens uh, when we when we study in books uh, are an ideal case is that every system is linear but when we design it uh, no system is no, uh, no system is linear so what happens uh, the harmonic distortion it's, it's like a measure of the amount of uh, the power which contain in the harmonics so uh, it also in, in other words it, it, it defines how much non-linear our system is that means the uh, more harmonic distortion means uh, the system is more non-linear or vice versa okay so for TAG we have to select this and fundamental resolution 50 and uh, I'll show this output so this is the total harmonic distortion plot for our RF circuit so like like this you can you can plot uh, there are many other functions here also if you want to um, uh, check them power gain or uh, voltage gain transconductance transhumanist okay thank you all